A couple's American dream shattered when a thief took their food truck last fall. Tonight, its owners are back in business thanks to community support. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith is in Tampa with their rebound. Yes, they can. Marco Falcone spent decades perfecting his pie recipe in his home country of Italy, but he always had his eyes on the American dream. It's more trailer. We just more good by another one. Third one, you know, in this part of my business. But before those expansion plans could take off, COVID hit. He and his wife poured their life savings into simply surviving. Then in mid-November, someone stole their food truck in the middle of the night. It's horrible, horrible. When you work hard for uh, some years, no day off for years. Work 12 hours a day. I found out trailer thefts are on the rise in Hillsborough County. 70 trailers were reported stolen from January through April this year, a 35% increase compared to the same time last year. I wouldn't be exaggerating if I said that 5% of our sales are to customers that have just lost a trailer to theft. Michael Gatewood of Bigfoot Trailers urges all owners to use a hitch lock or wheel boot and mark your trailer in a hidden area like underneath the frame so it's easier to ID if recovered stolen. At Bigfoot, we actually weld a number on the, the frame that's not related to the VIN number, and that way the, the thieves don't think there's any reason to take that off. This is my new start. Falcone is now back in business, loyal customers and strangers donating thousands to help his family buy a new food truck and trailer. His American dream made from scratch. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Falcone tells me business has doubled since reopening this year. In fact, they plan on buying two more food trucks, one for pasta, another for gelato, soon creating their own unique, authentic Italian food court. In Tampa, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.